Now, what do I have in my bag of tricks? Extra thick gasket. What's this all about? Let's see what this is we're talking about here. It's a rubber gasket. It's a, like a heavy donut. And, you know, it's that ring again. I, and it's like, what the heck is that for? Never quite knew what that was for. Like, are you supposed to put a nut in here like this and tighten it up? That's the wrong way. What the deal is that? Well, here, I'm going to take the mystery out of it for you. Okay, you've got this tight, right? Remember I showed you a different way to put this up here, a different gasket? Well, they come up with different gaskets again. And here's a different one right here. If you look on the back side, there's little notches. It's like, hmm, hey. Maybe it fits on like this. And those lines are for where the nut is. And this fits over that. And see there's an indentation in here. See that indentation? That allows for where this nut is. When I put that nut on, it's going to fit right in there. Okay? Does it matter how far this is sticking out? Well, let's see. Put this on. Ah, this is kind of cool. Look at that. Voila. Wow, it fits right on there. You don't have to hang on to it or anything. Why don't why doesn't everybody use one of those? I mean, you could use that. This one says an extra thick gasket. So apparently that means they have another one just like this that's not extra thick. Well, is there, does it matter? If you've got these bolts coming through here, that just means you're going to have a little bit more of a gap right here between the tank and your bowl. But not very much. It's hardly anything. It's minuscule. Then you're going to need three bolts to come out through here, right? Fooey on this. You don't need this at all, do you? On this type of system, don't get all hung up on trying to find something exactly like this if this is the type that your toilet has because guess what newsflash you may not need this and even if you did have this maybe you can't get reach in there and get that nut tight enough right is there any other way we can do this this is getting kind of fun Does Joe have any more tricks up his sleeve? Here's another one. Bolt and gasket set pretty much like that big heavy donut like this. I just call that a donut. I don't know exactly what they call it. Just a rubber gasket. Okay, and this one says fits two or three bolt applications, meaning if you got three bolts down here or if you only got the two bolts. So, okay, we're going to get rid of this one. This was the extra thick one. Bye-bye. Extra thick gasket. This is the bolt and gasket kit. Now, this one doesn't say it's extra thick, but see, it's got that cutout right in there, just like this one. You be the judge. Is this one is this one here extra thick? I mean, man, it almost looks the same. It could be ever so slightly thicker. This one's just about the same. How come this one's sort of gray? It's still pliable. It's rubbery. So is this one. Okay. And this one's got the definite notches in the back. You see that? Okay. That fits right over here again. I'm almost inclined to think I'm going to use this one here. But we'll just go through the motions here so we can decide. Make sure I've got it pushed up there nice and even. I guess that would be the trick. And see, this said two or three bolt application. So that's nice. It comes with three bolts in case I need three, which I do. And it came with six rubber washers. And I need six, don't I? 
Okay. And it came with six washers. I don't really need six washers, do I? They just gave me extra. I mean, I could double up the washer, but I don't really need to. You know? And I don't really think I want to put a washer inside the toilet um, because those could rust. This, this bolt is brass, okay? So I'm going to look at that. I, can, I could check that out and read the directions on the back. And uh, it says... just to use the rubber gasket for the washer and that's the part you're going to put in the toilet tank okay just like that there's your washer right then like we did before put one washer there the rubber washer the metal washer and the nut okay and look at that they gave me six I might be confusing you because I pulled this one over from over here. There's three, three total. Let me read this here. Six brass plated nuts, six stainless steel washers. Okay, they just give you six for extra. You know, there you go. And I think this is the way I'm going to do this. Only because... I feel more comfortable being able to tighten this down by myself here, you know, instead of using this one that was in there before. This just seems like a big headache and an accident ready to happen to where I just can't get it in there tight enough, you know? So pick your poison, whichever way it is. Now you can make an educated decision while you're at the store.